Hi, and welcome to another Daily Dose of Poetry. I'm Taz. Hello. <laughs> Hello. And I'm Ellie Mar. <laughs> or a frightened puppy. I, For like, there's, I have not now come into my human form so I can introduce our special guest for today, who I met at a poetry event, Samira yeah. Sadek. Thank Hi. you so much for coming. Thank you so much for having me. Oh, but of course. <laughs> so you are a truly hybrid human. You are in the realm of freelance journalism, mm -hmm. international reportage, but you are also a true poet at heart. Yes. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Yeah, I started my journalism, I think, t wow, 10 years ago now, and it was just because I was lost in high school, and I was like, okay, I guess I'll write. Um, Wait, were you in like the high school paper? I was, but I wasn't super involved. I think I wrote like a, a college essay, and someone was like, "Oh, your writing's really good. You should be a journalist." And I was like, "Okay." And then I just, and then I just went with it, and I never stopped. So. When you get a good suggestion, yeah, you know, you know just... and now I'm like, "Oh wow!" I just went off. I I made an entire career out of someone's suggestion. That's that's cute, but sure. Um, yeah, and then I uh, and I became a poet much later. It actually started out of a Tumblr blog because I was heartbroken. <laughs> But now, but now I've come past that, so that's great. <laughs> you must have to deal then with quite a few different types of problems when you're working, whether in the world of journalism or in the inner realm of the poets. Yes, <laughs> a lot. But uh, but my life's current biggest, most annoying problem is I'll say annoying because I feel like it's probably more dealable. But um, I live by the L train, and I was getting very hopeful that it's not going to shut down. But uh, now it is. Wait, Wait it's is there more news? Down? It's reshutting down. It's like going to be off from the twenty sixth till the till twenty sixth of April till summer twenty twenty. <gasps> They're like pink flyers. It's no, very happy looking. No, I live on the L train too. <laughs> there are flyers all, and it looks so happy that you don't register it at first. You're like, oh, that's cute. Is it like no. a little summer flyer? Fire. All right. Well, I think I think this is gonna need a strong prescription. <laughs> yeah. All right, For both of us. Let's get our like. typewriters. <laughs> Entrepreneur drivers can take destiny into hand, or better said, on to wheel, charged to carpool, sleek as eels. My very raw disappointment at hearing the news of the L train is in this poem, so it's it's a haiku. Redirect not trains, but budgets, special interests, delay Albany. Thank you. <laughs> and where can people find you on social media? I am on Instagram as Samira Sadik with a very complicated spelling. So okay, just, would you spell it out? Yeah, let me do that. S-A-M-I-R-A -A underscore S-A-D-E-Q-U-E. Oh. And on Twitter as S-A-M-I-D-E-Q-U-E because I've shortened my two names. Sorry. Thank, Thank you, you so much for being Thanks here. Thanks for the poems and the prescriptions. And if you love poems, and you love the subway, and you love being alive, subscribe to our channel. Daily Dose of Poetry